Hey everyone, it's your girl Kay. Welcome back to Let's Play Franbo Part 11. Let's figure out why did Edward trap us in this room? Where did Mr. Midnight go? What the hell is going on? Let's find out. There, see, it's just sitting there. Isn't that a strange behavior? That's a fucking stuffed animal, my guy. It's just a toy. From what I see, it's just a toy, sir. It won't move. Would you please try to make contact with it? I don't dare touch it. All right, sir. I'll take the rabbit and show you there's nothing to be afraid of. Oh, boy. Oh, gosh. It's going to jump out at me and fucking strangle me. See? It's just a fluffy rabbit. Nothing to be afraid of. Oh, you are right, friend. There's nothing to be afraid of. <gasps> Mr. Finney! Don't go! This, this is not funny. Oh! <gasps> What the fuck, Richard? He took Mr. Midnight! Oh, look, a little boat. <laughs> it word made a paper boat. Fuck it, word! One. Can I flip it? Two. Green leaves. I got a carrot. Three. That's an Etherstar uh, language. What's that? Yes, I found a battery. It looks like the machine needs some energy to wake up. Where do we put the battery? Oh, we need to open this first. We need like a wrench. Oh, would you look at that? Fuck yes! Okay. Okay. Gotta go get Mr. Midnight back, that bitch! Wanna fucking take my cat, motherfucker! I'm gonna shove something up his ass! There you go, battery place, and yes, it works! all that did. Frank? Oh. Oh! Upsie daisy! Are those my parents? Are you? Ooh! Mommy and Daddy, who did this to you? Why are you here? Please tell me. Uh, they don't look like they can really communicate at the moment. Okay. Oh, the teapot is facing a specific way. Hello. There's nobody in there. Is this to make music with the wind? Water symbol. I guess it's connected to something. I've seen these on movies. The thief always knows what to do. Okay, there's the dot. Hold on. Let's go see what all those numbers were about. Maybe there's some clues inside as to what we're doing up here. Alright, Mr. Rabbit. Oh, why did you scare Edward? Anyway, you're very cute. I don't think he's scared Edward. I think Edward is trying to trap us in here because why would he just snatch Mr. Midnight like that? Why? It doesn't make any fucking sense. Okay, let's see. Why is everything placed where it is? One. I don't know. I thought it was something. What a lovely little tree! 
I do have a wrench still, so it might still be useful later down the road. A pencil, I don't need it. Okay, well. What's this? Oh. Okay. We need to find a way to get this to precisely go. The wind is blowing rather heavily. It's just barely missing it. Be done. Hmm. It's a huge metallic swirl like back in Ethersta. <clears throat> These are just regular flags. Okay. Hmm. What the fuck? <sighs> oh. I need to learn how to like get back in the habit of using my pills in every other like room direction and shit. Oh, a mechanical rabbit. That's not very cute. Maybe the rabbit is angry or hungry or both. Hey look, it's dressed like me. Oh, why did you scare it word away? Anyway, you're cute. Uh, that's not exactly what it said. But Pointing to the cart. Oh. I need to get the order again. So, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. That's the order. Just do this. One. Two, three, four, five. Two's being blocked by Bun Bun over there. That's five. This is five. Okay, so it only has arrows pointing here, 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 and then here. This, I mean, that kind of looks like there is an arrow there, but I can't- Oh wait, what if we give him a carrot? Would you like a carrot? Here you go. Five. Okay. 
There's a one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, we have our combination. Take me away! Okay. Eight to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, five to the right. One, two, three, four, five, eight to the left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, six to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six, five, nine to the left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. What the fuck? Oh, wait, it unlocked. I thought it said it was locked. I was like, what? No! Oh, boy. I don't see very well. It's quite dark. Surprise, Fred! Happy birthday! Today's my dad's birthday. Happy birthday, Dad. Oh, a birthday party! Wow, I thought you wanted to kill Mr. Midnight. You lied to me. Well, I lied to you in order to keep your attention in another direction. I'm very sorry I had to fool you, my friend. We wanted to surprise you, my dear friend. Come and eat cake. Fuck you guys! All right, then. Thank you, Kitty. You really surprised me. Thank you, Edward. No, fuck you guys. That was terrifying. The cake is made of all the ingredients you like. Mr. Midnight told me which ones. And we have something very special for you from all members of the ship. That means all of us naturally born or handmade beings. Here you go. I hope you find it educational. Oh, wow. I love the wrapping. Can I open it now, please? Yes, go ahead and open it. Aw, that's kind of cute. Oh, wow, a cat doll. Thank you so much. I love it. It's beautiful. Did I just see a padlock on its stomach as it faded away? Play that back. I feel like I did. If not, I'm just crazy and I'm sorry. I love it so... I love it. It's beautiful. It may give your eyes a new perception. You know, like the ultra reality. Is that what happens when I take red pills, sir? Is the ultra reality what I see? Well, it depends. Would you like some explanations? Yes. Yes, please. Look, what you've seen is a mixture of different realities. And the ultra reality is like an invisible room where everything exists at the same time. For example, at this exact coordinate of time and space, we're having a birthday party. But in the ultra reality, other things are happening all the time slower, faster, or just invisible to the human eye. It's because of time, humans can define past, present, and future. Defining things encapsulates reality. It gives humans a chance to understand their environment. You have a different perception of the environment. It's not linked to definitions. Do you understand what I say? I'm not sure, sir. I think maybe I feel a bit dizzy. Ah, haha, <laughs> that may be the ship going up and down. Blow on the candles now, dear. We're about to reach our destination. You mean we're about to get home? Did you hear that, kitty? Yes, we are about to arrive. Really? Wow, how exciting. All right, here I go. Crash. Just kidding. I fucking called it. Oh, no, no, no. Oh dear, what's happening, Mr. Midnight? Are you all right? I'm all right, but I hope the ship won't break. It sounds dangerous. What's up, man? Fran, you have to help. I have to drive the machine again. The automatic driver was destroyed by the Camelas. There is there is one left alive. You have to get rid of it. Find it fast. How do I do that, sir? Water. That cleans the dirt. Hurry up now. Remember, it may be hiding from your eyes. Oh my goodness, Kitty, I'm scared. Me too, Fran. We have to find the Camilla. I really hope the water destroys it. Let's go. All right, time to have the medications. Okay, it's not up here. We're just gonna kind of backtrack real quick. Let's check everywhere. Is this still locked or can I? 
It, this is locked. Okay. Kinda hard to try in here. Down the ladder, my dear. God, that is such a loving sight to see. <sighs> Hiya! It could work if I had water inside the bucket. Motherfucker, why don't you have water inside of the bucket? Why don't you have water inside of the bucket? to do everything for you, Fran. My god! I tried that earlier and it wouldn't do it. Didn't I? Oh well. Irrelevant. Splash! Oh fuck. Please don't eat me. Ugh, don't run away. Where are you going? Go get more water, I guess. You ruined my birthday party. Oh, I don't have one anymore. I don't have a bucket. Please don't move. I have to pour some water on you. With what? With what? I don't have my bucket. Where's my bucket? There's no point in messing with that. What happened to my bucket? I wanna see this real quick. Yes, I did! Oh, is that a keyhole? I wonder if that was like a glitch or something like as it was supposed to transition into the backpack, the layers just kind of evaporated as well. Okay, I need something to pour onto the Camilla. I- wait, wait, I'm stupid. I am so stupid. Sorry guys. Sorry guys. Hold on, hold on. We're going. It clicked. Don't worry. It just did the thing. Fuck. Oh yeah! Wait. Sorry. It's facing the wrong way. Oh yeah! You sneaky little thing, it's time for your bath! Or your shower, more like. I think I finally got rid of the Camilla. I'm the best! I should go back to Itward. Fuck that guy, honestly. <laughs> I don't trust him anymore! Surprise birthday party, my ass! Edward, sir, we did it. The camel is gone. It's gone? Yes, but it's too late, dear. I can't take you home. Why? We're going down. No, oh, please don't tell me this. It's not fair. It's not fair. Oh, shit. I will always take care of you, my dear. And the ship was going down until it crashed. Everything was destroyed. The end. What? But that is a very sad ending, Edward. Tell me another story, please. Alright, this is the story of Fran Bo and me. When she promised never to forget me or about the magic of everything. Hee <laughs> hee, I promise it, word. I'll never forget you. Good. Now it's time to sleep. Expect me in your dreams, my friend. Chapter 4, Part 2, Doctor's Prescription. Whew! I thought we reached the end of the game. I was like, no! Oh, 
was a deer. Hi, Bambi. I'm alive! I'm just kidding. <laughs> it word? Oh. Are we back in like reality reality? I see street lamps. Ow, kitty, we're alive. We survived the crash. Oh dear, yes, we are alive. Yay! Hmm, but Edward is gone. He brought us home. We're outside of town. We're outside the town. Fran, I can smell it. Are you sure, Kitty? Are we already home? I thought you would be happier about it. What is it? It's just I wonder where Edward is. I wish I could say goodbye. Maybe you can take the medicine and see him again. Yes, Kitty, but I took all the pills already. You see, the bottle is empty. Anyways, let's go home. Maybe Edward will come to me someday. Aww! Well, I think I'm gonna end it here. We've done so much. We've progressed. I literally almost thought this was the end of the game. Holy shit. I was about to rage. Fucking rage! Um, but anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed Frambo Part 10. Stay tuned for Part 11, where we continue on our journey and try to get home. So, leave a like and comment, subscribe, hit the bell option to get notifications about when I post. All of my social media accounts are linked in the description below if you want to stay in the loop of everything that's going on. Thank you all again so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!